we're on. Welcome back, everybody. Today's video, if you're looking for a cell phone under $100 for yourself or for somebody else, maybe for one of your kids, and you don't want to spend a whole lot of money, these are all under $100. They do have some that's between, uh, that's less than 50 bucks also. These are under a hundred, and the first one, if you want to see the video, please. The first one I'm going to review is the Alcatel 1X 16 gigabyte, 2 RAM, 2 gigabyte RAM, 5.3, 5 MP 4G LTE GSM factory un unlocked smartphones. These are all unlocked phones, by the way. And you do them with any carrier carrier you would like to do and it's uh, black according to this and this is what it looks like that is what it looks like the specifications on it let me go, go down to it about this item um it says the Apple 1X is a GSM factory unlocked and comes with 16 gigabytes of internal storage. It also has 2 gigabytes of RAM. This smartphone comes equipped with a 5.3 inch screen. I'm guessing that's what it means. It has a Snapdragon 425 processor instead of MediaTek chip and lower resolution camera, 5 megapixel main. And two megapixel selfie. The phone is notable for its tall 2.1 aspect ratio, which is still uncommon in truly entry level phones such as this. The phone has a memory card slot, 2.5 mm audio jack, comes with Google Lens image rec recognition. It says it comes with a battery, of course. It's back and locked. It's black. Uh, the battery says the charging time is less than three and a half hours. Um, yeah, that's that's it on that one, everybody. Okay, the next one. Hold on just a second. I'm gonna go down to it. When you go back to the page you was on, it was this this next one is Motorola Droid Ultra Unlocked. This one is 6234. The one I talked about before this one was 5990. This one is 6234. And this is what it looks like. Going out to the info. Alright. Okay. The Motorola Droid Ultra comes with a 5 inch display. The device is both thinner and more durable than earlier devices thanks to the new unibody Kevlar construction. Kevlar construction. Thickness comes at the slim 7.18 mm, making this the thinnest 4G LTE phone out there. A brand new dual core X8 mobile computing system is powering the device, allowing exciting new features like touchless control that has your phone listening to you at all times. There's also the active display technology that only lights up a part of the screen to conserve battery. A dual core processor is what's under the hood. The Droid Ultra features a an Elf slash 2.410 megapixel camera. Um, but yeah, that's that's the info on it. And it looks like it's a nice phone. Going to the next one. 
Sorry, y'all. About to get frustrated with my computer. This one is a Motorola also. Motorola Moto G3. I will show you guys what it looks like. It's $67.95. This is what it looks like. The, um, It says it is water resistant, worry proof. You need you need your phone to be there for you in less than ideal conditions. It says this phone is rated is water protect is rated water protection keeps the phone safe from splashes and drops in water. Uh, it says after an accidental splash in the in a puddle or sink, for example. Just drop off your phone and keep going. Now, me, I wouldn't say take it in the shower with you or take it swimming with you because it probably won't survive that. Um, it says it has a Corning Gorilla Glass display. You need a phone that can stand up to your demanding lifestyle. Corning Gorilla spans Moto G from early, nearly from nearly edge to edge. To help keep your phone protected from unsightly scrap, scrapes and scratches. All day battery. Now, before I go into the all day battery, I do recommend, from personal experience, to get a phone case for your cell phone. Whatever phone you're going to choose, get a phone case for it. Even if you have to order it offline somewhere. Please, because this will help protect your phone. Because this cell phone that I have, that I'm using, I have dropped it I don't know how many times, and thank God I have a case on it. It has saved my phone. Oh, yeah. So, that's my recommendation. For this. Any phone you purchase. Alright. All day battery. It says the Moto G is designed to last a full day and then with a 20 2470 megahertz battery. You can go about your jam packed day and not worry about the battery life. Go to school, work, visit friends, and head out for the evening and still have enough juice to get home. Customize your Moto G. You can customize uh, by choosing your front, back, and accent colors in the Moto Maker. It says you can even engrave your name or a phrase on the back. Buy an additional Moto roller shell to display different colors. A Moto will flip shell to protect your phone front and back. Performance. Moto G runs Android Lollipop free from unnecessary software and slows you down. Moto display lets you fulfill preview notifications and updates. Uh... It says it responds to your motions and gestures. It has a fast Qualcomm Snapdragon 14 processor, 5 inch HD display. It has it's 4G LTE. So, yeah. Um, that is the specification on that one. Like this one too. Um, the next one, you guys. Well, it's also a Motorola. I'm getting there, y'all. Hold on, you're doing next page. Hold on. Hold on. My dog. My baby. My, my, my baby. My sweet baby. What are you doing? 
Well, pickle, here it is. Motorola Moto G5 Plus. This one is in lunar gray. Let's see. It. I like this one. This one's $82.49. Looks like it's okay. Can get a protection plan for it as well. I'm thinking you probably get protection plans for the other one I've reviewed. Okay. Okay, screen size is 5.2. It's unlocked. Color says it's gray. Storage capacity. Inches camera is 12 MP sensors is fingerprint accelerometer gyro proximity and compass on this one. Um, does it take? It says you can make brilliant photos. Has style points, power couple. This says, it says, you can do up to six hours of battery life with just a quick 15 minute charge. Instant gratification, sweet shortcuts. So yeah, that's what comes with that. And, um, you know, of course, always you can read further details and stuff on these phones. You know, review them even more. I'm just briefly reading, reviewing them. Reason being is I have um, I have some more I'm gonna review, and I believe it's some. It might be a, 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 a iPhone in one of these. I think or something of that nature, or maybe even a. Um, Okay, the next one is a Motorola Moto G5 Plus. This one is $84.99. It's 32 gigabytes. And this is what it looks like. That's the back of it. That's what it looks like. Like I said, okay. Let's read some of the stuff on it. Okay. 5.2 inch display. Uh, 10 by 80, 1080 by 1920 pixels. Corning glass, Corning Gorilla Glass. Flash and dust resistant, internal memory 32 gigabytes, 2 gigabytes RAM, micro USB 2.0. Um, the battery says it's 3000 mAh capacity with fast charging. It's Android 12 MP primary camera with 1.7 dual pixel. Dual pixel PDAL, uh, dual LED dual tone flash panorama, panor panorama plus five MP front facing camera with 2.2. That's that one. The next one is a Google Pixel. I like this one. Okay, let's go back. This one is 8841. This one 
is what it looks like. It's the only two picks it's got. That's the first one. Alright, this one here, like I said, is a Google Pixel unlocked. 32 gigabytes, 5 inch screen on this one. Let's, let's go to description and I'm going to briefly read the stuff, okay? Um, screen is 5.0, past C storage 32 inch, camera is 12.3 MP, sensors is fingerprint, gyro, compass, and barometer, whatever that means. Uh, it says your battery charges fast. You can get up seven hours of battery life, of life in just 15 minutes. This is built for VR. It says you can take smarter photos. You're on Google Assistant. Um, it's got Pixel on it. Because your phone never full. So you will. It says it has unlimited storage for your photos and videos. So anyways, that's just a brief description of this one. But if that's one you're interested in, you know, of course, you, know, you can look at it more. And everything guys and gals okay the next one is a Samsung Gal Galaxy A01 core A0 13M 16GB duo let me go down to that one this one is $89 and it comes in red because the other colors are out so it still comes in red okay it also has black and blue but they're out right now I'm drinking a smoothie okay that's what this one looks like like I said, this is the Samsung Galaxy A1 Core A01 13 16 gigabyte duo unlocked DSM Android smartphones in red. That's, what it looks like. That's the back of it. Why is that so? Like I said, this one eighty nine dollars. Remember, these are all all off of Walmart dot com. Okay. Okay. Here we go. It has a five point three inch display. Resolution is seven twenty by fourteen eighty pixel. Touch screen, of course. Memory sixteen gigs. Um, micro SD main camera 8ML 2.2 with LED flash selfie camera 5MP 2.4 it has a non removable battery most of these I've noticed about Motorola well this is not Motorola though but the Motorola ones from what I've noticed, the, you can't remove the battery. I have, I have had one, and I couldn't remove the battery. So, but I didn't have to get a battery for it. Instead, like I was saying, please get a case for these phones. Because that one, I dropped it, and I didn't have a case on it, and I shattered the screen. Y'all, I was heartbroken, because I really like that phone. Because I, I really like Motorola phones, also as well. But, like I said, you know, please get a case for these phones, you know. And I know the batteries aren't removable, 
And that, you know, that's probably the only downside I didn't like about it, you know, blah, 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 in case I had to get another battery. But then I thought, you know what, probably just the same price, if not cheaper, to get another phone. So, you know. Alright, here we go. Um, but yeah, that's the that's the specifications on it. Remember that one was a Samsung Galaxy A1 Core. You hear you? Oh. Okay. Go to the next one. This one is a Nokia. Now, back in the day, Nokia was the phone. Y'all remember when the Nokia came out with a little bitty phone that was handheld, you know, and all that? That was the phone back in the day, y'all. That was like my very first phone I ever had. I think. So now they're making them touch screen and nice size. This one looks like it's a pretty good size. This one's a Nokia 1.3 TA-1207 16 gigabyte for $99. This is what it looks like, y'all. Yeah. Nice looking phone to me. That's the back of it. I like the color. I don't know what color that would be, but I like that color. It looks blue to he on here when I'm holding up here. When I do it like this, it actually looks like it's like a teal looking color, maybe something like that. Yes, okay. Let's read. I'm sorry, they're out of that color. Okay. It's hot C Y A M, but they do have charcoal in it. currently in stock and the same price, $99. Alrighty. Oh, Alright, let's see. Here we go. I'm going to read the brief description on this, okay? This play is 5.7 inches. PS LCD tactics touchscreen resolution is 1560 by 720 pixels. Internal memory 16 gigabytes, 1 gigabyte RAM, micro SD up to 400 gigabytes. Rear camera 8MP with A1 low light enhancement and LED. Front facing camera 5MP. Wi Fi 802.11. Bluetooth 4.2. Removal. This one has a removable fabric. Is it? Dimensions 5.80 by 2.80 by 0.37 inches, weight 5.47 ounces. So that's that one. Anyways, so let's go to the next one. Alright, the next two I'm looking at, y'all. There's several of them on here, y'all. Hold on. Sorry. Okay. I'm back, y'all. I'm sorry about that. I had to take it back to the phone call. Anyway, so we got five more, I think, I'm gonna review for this one. Um the next one, y'all, is two Google phones. The first one is a Google Pixel. Uh, two PW 4132 gigabyte. This one's in silver. It's $99. I like this phone too. Pull it up. I'll show you guys what it looks like. This is what it looks like. Scroll the back of it, of course. On again. Um, 
on this. The Google Pixel unlocks is the first Android phone to be branded as Google. It is, has similar features for its Apple rival to its Apple rival. It does kind of look like an Apple phone. Um, including a metal and glass design, fingerprint reader, and a 12 megapixel camera. The display is slightly larger than 5 inches on the Google Pixel versus the iPhone 7, with iPhone 7 which measures 4.7 inches and also features an 8 megapixel front facing camera versus 2 versus, I'm sorry, 7 megapixel on the iPhone. The Google Pixel phone can also record in slow motion and 4K Ultra HD. Um, it will work with any carrier, it says. So, that is what it's saying on this one. Okay, okay. The phone is unlocked to work with any GSM carrier like AT&T, T-Mobile, like that. It will not work with CDMA carriers like Boots Mobile, Sprint, Verizon, Virgin Mobile. Okay, so. Sorry for y'all who have something else besides AT&T or T-Mobile or whatever. Okay. But I, it's a nice phone though, and I really like that one, and it does look like the iPhone. The next one is a Google Pixel. 32, hold on now, I've got to go back down to it, oh, 32 gigabytes, GSM, CDMA, it's black, it's 9988, I'll show you what it looks like, I'm going down to the, the specification, on, but this is what it looks like. Okay. It's only biggest guy that we've ever done. Okay. Um, 32 gigabytes unlocked. CD you made unlocked. That's all it said. It doesn't say anything else about it, but I um, mean like it. it's a nice looking phone. Um, the next one is a Motorola XT. I'm reading y'all. 1585 Droid Turbo 2 30 Turbo 2 32 gigabytes. Verizon 5.4 Oh, AM OLED display, 3 gigabyte RAM, 21 MP camera, and this is what it looks like. All right, let me pull up the description on this one. Or try to, y'all. Okay, here we go. Key features and benefits. Moto Shutter Shield Display. Great protection with 5.4 AM OLED HD display. 48 hour battery. High capacity. 3760 mAh battery powers through two days. Turbo power charging. Long battery life. Water repellent. Guarded by advanced nano coating technology. Processor. Ultra powerful. Qualcomm Snapdragon 810 21 MP camera captures good, beautiful true to life images in any light. So you get the phone. This is what's included the phone, the battery, and the power adapter. 
but yeah, I like that one too, y'all. I do. And um, let's go back to the page just finished reviewing. Okay, we got one more. If I'm not mistaken, one more. Go down to it. Nokia Lumia. Nokia Lumia. I think I'm saying it right now. If I'm not, don't. Please don't. Please don't correct. You know, please don't jump on me, okay? Uh, it's a Nokia Lumia 900, 16 gigabyte Windows, AT&T GSM Global Unlocked Smartphone. Okay, I'm going to show you what it's like. Go down to the details on it. Okay. If this is what it looks like. I was showing what comes in the package on this one. Okay. I like this song too, y'all. My dog was looking at me like, what are you doing? Okay, let's read a brief description on this one. Uh, discover a smarter way to work and play with thousands of apps from the Windows Phone Marketplace with Nokia Lumina 900 cell phone. The 4.3 clear black LED display provides superb clarity in vibrant colors for easy viewing indoors or out. With the, with the back 8MP camera with autofocus flash and Carl Zeiss lens, you can take clear photos and videos quickly and easily. The phone also has a 1MP front-facing camera that can be used for video chatting. The Nokia Lumen, Lumia 900 unlock phone also lets you listen to your favorite music with Zoom music player and built-in FM radio. Hi! The 16 gigabyte of storage, this device gives you plenty of room for your music videos and pictures. Internal storage is 16 gigabytes, 512 megabytes of RAM. Uh, network unlocked cell phones is compatible with carriers like AT&T and T-Mobile, as well as GS GSM SIM cards. Okay. This example on that is Metro P Metro PCS. It says it will not work with carriers. It will not work with carriers like Sprint. Rise and Boost Mobile or Virgin Mobile, unless otherwise stated. Okay. You know, this, um, but this was the last one I was going to review, y'all. Um, but I wanted to just, just quickly just say that even if it says it might not work, um, with, Uh, it won't work with a certain carrier. Just double check to make sure. Because you don't never know. It might say that. And then come to find out it will. So like I said, just check on that. You know, whatever carrier you're going to try to go with. Um, also, like I said previously, please get a case for these cell phones. Please. Please. You know, and everything. Even if they say they're shatterproof or they're drop proof or whatever the case is to be on the safe side please i'm asking y'all please get cake to save you some heartache and some money um that's basically it that was the last one i think i was gonna do with reviewing cell phones um and everything if i'm not mistaken but this these were off of walmart.com now i have done some videos off of, um, come to me in a minute, y'all. I'm sorry. Uh, I did Best Buy phones under 50 or and 100, I think, on Best Buy. I've also done watches, smart watches, off of Amazon, Best Buy, and Walmart, if I'm not mistaken. 
check those videos out because you know if you're shopping for you or someone else and it's something I have reviewed that you might be interested in check it out you know you never know if it's that's what you want to go with or not and everything so just just see and I'm sorry this video is 30 something minutes long I really need them now but um I've reviewed a I mean, 10 phones maybe something like that I don't know exactly how many but like I said um, I hope you guys like these videos. If you do, please like and subscribe. Let me know what you would like to see, if I can do it. I have other ideas for other videos that I'm going to go in that direction eventually. Um, and everything. So, I'm just trying to do a variety of what y'all may like. And everything. Just let me know, please. And, uh, you know, please don't be rude. I'm asking, please don't be rude. Please don't be posting comments or something on there that's just a bunch of boo-boo, okay? You know, just be nice about it and everything. Because, Lord knows, we all need to be very nice to each other and help each other. So, anyways, with that being said, I'm going to end this video here. And until next time, I will see you then. Everyone stay safe healthy and happy as much as possible.